We're here with Tyler Childers, who's just put out a great new record. How many weeks old is it now? Uh, August 4th, so one day is today. Whatever. It's uh, about a month, I guess. Yeah, we don't have to carbon date it, but I'll tell you, it's all over WMOT. Cool. Uh, I appreciate your request. Uh, and, and you have to tell us how you got to this path. I mean, there's obviously a Sturgill Simpson connection, but you didn't start playing yesterday. No. Um, been playing for a long bit, you know, started out for free beers and then, uh, you know, graduated and got into bars and started playing for uh, free beers that I didn't need a fake ID for and then I was like, man, I need to start making some money, <laughs> you know, and so I've been playing on the road uh, pretty heavily for the last little bit. Have and you always had a traditionalist kind of voice and approach? Just kind of just... I mean, you're... Out of, out of the Wayland Jennings School. I mean, you clearly have a respect for vintage country music and that sound. Yeah, I'm a big fan of Night Train. So out of uh, Lawrence County, Kentucky. Quit your job and party. Cold beer and fried bologna. All that stuff. So I was, I got a kick out of here in Shell Silverstein. Yeah. Where'd that come from? It's just like Dr. Hook. <laughs> Dr. Hook? Yeah. Really? Yeah, D Dr. Hook done it on a... Uh, Sloppy seconds? Yeah, Maybe. yeah, yeah. I don't know. Well, uh, the entire Nashville country community loved Shell. Uh, yeah. And, you know, Bobby Baird, Tom T. Hall, that was yeah. those were a winner. People. So it, it's always been weird music, but it really fits in a country vibe. So it's good stuff. So you've got a very successful album. Are you touring now? Are you out there touring? Yes, we've been uh, touring. Uh, we just got done with like a 27 day run. Well, no, two weeks have went by since then, but we don't. I guess we're not keeping count. Um, yeah, we've been staying busy. Uh, I got uh, two more weeks of shows, and then I think we get a breather for four days. It's just kind of just stay busy, you know. Everybody who's watching this is also listening to WMOT, so this man's voice will be all over the air. Uh, the uh, music director who just ran into. She's programming like five songs off the album, so it's uh, <laughs> man. I appreciate y'all like keeping thank me in rotation. It's well, awesome. Thank you and congratulations.